Alrighty, hello guys, welcome your faces back to another Stormworks video. Today we are going to be building an Ekrano plan to uh, take part in my challenge. Uh, so, if you guys haven't heard about the challenge already, the challenge is to build an Ekrano plan. Yes, we've already figured that out. Uh, it's basically just a plane that works on ground effect, but there is no ground effect in Stormworks. Uh, but we don't have to worry about that because we'll just put an altitude hold on and we'll make the plane fly very close to the water, basically. So, that's what we're going to get on with today. Let's go ahead and start building the, um, the, the, yeah, let's just go start building it. Okay, so even though it's supposed to spawn in the water, we're going to actually build ours in, uh, the hangar inside here because, um, it seems like a better place to do it. We got a much bigger wingspan, although the wingspan on these things isn't that big. Anyway, right, so, we're gonna start off by building the cockpit area, because the cockpit area seems like the best place to start. So, uh, with that being said, what we'll do is we'll grab a, one of these, hold on, there it is, a four by one, yep, here we go, just pop that right there, yes. We're gonna go ahead and pop one of these on the side of it, uh, just like this, but press U, bosh, yes, very good. Uh, and then we're actually going to go back one more from there. Uh, but we're actually going to be using these pieces. Uh, if we can use the 2x2 two two inverse thingy-mabobby. Yep, here we go. Oh, this is going to look perfect if it fits. Hold on, go back one here. And then if we go back to the other thing. Oh, this should look really good. It should look really good. But if it doesn't, whatever. Here we go. Turn it around. Bosh that on there. Awesome. Yes. All right, then we can go sideways again. Oh, this is perfect. Yeah, so we do something like this. Uh, bop that on there. Good. Uh, and that's where the cockpit starts. Yeah, fantastic. Okay, bop this one on there as well. Awesome. The cockpit will go in the middle. That's fine. Uh, and then we'll go ahead and grab... Oh, yeah, how do we do the front? <laughs> I don't know. Uh, right, okay. Two by... Yep, this seems like a good idea. Go ahead and try and fit that on there. Press U. Uh, shove it into the right place. Like that. Good. And then the same thing can go on like here. Is that right? Nope, that's not right. That's not right. Uh, how do we fit anything onto that bit? Do we have to do it with this? I think we do. Yep, there we go. Like that. Awesome. And then we need another one of these, which is going to go right there. Uh, if we can fit that on. Press U again. Pop that on there. Oh, this is starting to look really good, actually. Yeah. So the cockpit's going to go right here. Uh, it's going to be a one-man thing. Uh, a one-man cockpit to begin with. Because I think that's a good idea. Um, and yeah, we'll see how it goes from there. So, pop this on there. Uh, put in the uh, the windows. Yep, let's start with the windows. Uh, I like using... I like using the odd ones, these things. I think they look cool. So, we'll use them. Here we go. Uh, we want them to go on there like that, though, to begin with. So, actually, if we can place in, like, a few blocks like this on the sides. And then get the thing again. Get one of these, change its color, and bop it on there. Then we might be able to make this thing look cool. Maybe. All right, put that right there. Good. Yes. All right, then we need the big windows, because we need to be able to see. <laughs> there we go. Awesome. Is that attached onto there properly? Not really. Um, flip this around, I think. Uh, I don't know. Press U. Now flip it. Oh, I don't know. It needs to kind of go there. Yeah, that's good. That's all right. Oh, that actually fits perfectly. Um, and then we grab one of these ones. We shove it in the middle. And whammo. Oh, that looks good. Yeah. So this is a one-man plane. Um, oh, one-man piloting plane. So it only gets piloted by one person. Um, the rest of the plane does does contain more people. Uh, there will be more people inside. Don't worry. Uh, so we put that there. Yes. Then we grab a window. Uh, one of these sideways ones. Um, probably actually... Um, where is it? Where's the other one? There it is. One of these. I want one of these in there. Uh, just to go on this piece. Like so. Yep, that looks good. That looks awesome. Uh, and then we fill in the rest of it with these pieces. Pop that on there. And we still want it to go round. So we'll still use these things. And hopefully, we can get it to go, like, down the side. Oh, boy. Uh, <laughs> this might look weird. This might look kind of weird. Uh, but we're going to use these, and um, we're going to have it come out sideways, like this. That does look kind of strange. 
Because it should really be like, I don't know, part a part of it maybe? Um, that's alright. Alright, cool. Uh, go ahead and shove one of these on there as well. There we go. If we can bring it backwards, that'd be great. Yeah. Uh, I think I want it to be more rounded than that though. So if we delete these pieces, okay. Uh, and we put on like a singular one. I think it's one of these. Yep, okay. If we fit this on here, then we should be able to round it off with one. Yeah, we can. Awesome. And then we do the same thing on this piece, like so. And we round it off with one again. Here we go. Yes. Oh, that's good. That's all right. Nice. Uh, let's have it go to a point on the front. So just like this. Put in this piece uh, right there. Uh, if I can. There we go. Good. Uh, that's maybe too pointy. Yeah, I think that's too pointy. Okay, right. If we grab one of these instead. One of the actual pointy ones. Wait, one of these. Yep. Oh, this will work. That's good. And then we need a, a two by one or whatever it's called. Where is it? One of these. A one by two. Here we go. Wash that on there. Yeah, that's okay. That's fine. Um, now what I did want to do was I think I'm going to allow this to come down one more. So we're going to grab these pieces, I think. Yep. Go underneath. Plug it on there. I think this is how it works. Uh, like so. Yeah, that's good. Um, then we grab... I feel like these things aren't going to work. Yeah, see, it's going to come out too much. Uh, but if we use this, then maybe it'll work. Hold on. Spin it around. Press U again. Put it there. Oh, dude. Yes. Oh, this is working way better than I thought it would. <laughs> That's awesome. Right, okay, grab one of these. Drag it around. Like like that. Yeah, sure. Press U. Pop that on there. Oh, dude, that's awesome. But actually, we don't want it to be like that. We want it to curve down more. Uh, and the way we do that is we grab one of these. Yep. And we put this on here. Perfect. All right. So that's going to continue going downwards. Yeah. Oh, that's awesome. That looks super cool. All right. Okay. Grab one of these. Put it on the front. That looks good. And then we need a, a one by two again, which is one of these things. And we'll bosh that right on the front of there. Yeah, I like it. I like it a lot. Uh, right, okay. So now, uh, we're going to have a flat front, pretty much. Uh, if we if we can put one of those on there. <laughs> that would be great. Uh, where does this go? Oh, it fits in here. It goes, it goes there. There we go. Actually, let's do this. Yep, that's brilliant. We need a one by one. There we go. Good. And then we need a one by four. Which is one of these ones. They go on there. And then we need a flat piece to go down the side. Awesome. I'm not sure whether it being flat is a good idea. But uh, it's fine. That's okay. Uh, no, it looks weird. It does. It looks weird. Okay, but actually, if we go ahead and we just copy and paste the entire thing uh, underneath and drag it up. Then maybe, if we only have one piece that's flat, it'll look alright, maybe? Question mark? I don't know. This might be fine. It might not be. We'll see. Uh, so we copy this. We flip it upside down. Turn it around. Drop it down. Um. Yeah, I wanted it to be like this big rather than rather than this big. But this big would work, I guess. Yeah. No, I'd like it to be bigger than that. Hmm. Yeah, let's go like... Maybe two? No, actually three? We can make it go down one more, I suppose. Yeah, let's do that. All right, okay. So delete all of this again, and we'll have it go down one more. Yes. Okay, how do we do that? <laughs> um, right, we need it to... Oh, actually, if it comes down just one, like this, and then we do these pieces on here, we can at least flatten out the first bit. Yep, good. And then this bit turns into this. Uh, which... Oh, no, it doesn't. It doesn't turn into that. What does it turn into? Oh, I don't know. Uh, like a one by something? A one by four? Yeah. I think that's... No, that's not right either. What is it? How do I connect to that bit? A one by two. Maybe it's one of these. Here we go. Press U. Yes, it's one of these. Aha! Fantastic. Good. All right, and then we, we put something on there. <laughs> a one by four? Question mark? 
E this is looking promising. Yep, good. And then we're actually gonna have it flat from from there, I think. Yeah, that looks all right. I mean, it's very. I don't know. I don't know whether I like it. It looks weird. It looks very strange. All right, okay. Clear content. Go ahead and grab the entire thing. So we go down one, bring it out, bring it up one. No, actually, that's it. That's it. That's everything. Copy it. Flip it. Turn it around. Pop it down. I don't know. Do we do we put a piece in the middle? I think we do. Yeah. All right. Okay. That's fine. Yep. Attach these together here. Good. Actually, all the way to the front. Yep. And then actually merge them. Perfect. Yeah. This is good. All right. Nice. Now attach all these together. Pop this piece in the center. And then the final piece is these ones, which is like a, I don't know, a one by two. I think. Is that right? I don't know if that's right. Hold on. What am I doing? What have I done? There we go. Oh, yeah. All right. That's not bad at all. I mean, it looks a bit weird, but it, it works. That totally works. All right. Awesome. So if we end up extending this out backwards... Uh, and we also fill in these pieces down here, because we don't want it. Well, actually, we should have it flat. A pretty flat, because, um, it needs to float. Yes. Okay, right, cool. Um, the wings are quite low to the water on these things. So if we do this, that's all right. If we do this, that's also all right. They're pretty, like, flat bodies, or, I don't know, they, they match quite well to each other. Okay, so that's good. Um, we don't want this to be huge. So what we're actually going to do is we're going to grab one of these. And we're going to put it on the back. Um, the other way up. Like this. Yes. Okay, so that's going to go down like that. Good. And then we need inner pieces. Which are going to do a similar thing. Like so. Yep. All right, good. I like that. That's cool. That might be too big, though, but it looks cool. <laughs> so we're going to keep it. Uh, right, okay, one. Uh, one by fours. Yes. Press U. Put them ones on. Oh, that's cool. All right, one by fours again. And then we'll, we'll connect it all at the top. Yes. Oh, that's an interesting looking thing. That is very interesting. Okay, we need to figure out what goes in there. <laughs> and we need to figure out what goes in here. But that's okay. We can sort all that out in a second. We grab one of these and we drag it around the top. Yep. And then we drag these pieces around here. Yep. And then we fill all that in in the middle. There we go. We've got a cockpit. Which actually looks alright. But it looks alright for a plane. Not an extra plan. It's kind of plan, 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 plan. An ekrano plan. Yeah, there we go. I got it. <laughs> I got it eventually. All uh, right. Okay. So it's gonna stay flat around here. That's okay. Uh, we are, of course, gonna fill in most of it though. So that bit's gonna be filled in from there onwards. Okay. From here back to there, and then from there onwards it is gonna be filled with things. Yeah. It's gonna be filled with uh these things. So if that goes on there. Like that, then we should be able to fill it all in. Although, actually, we could have done it with these pieces too. Never mind. Never mind at all. All right, bosh that in there. Good. We've done it. Fill this piece in in the center. Good. We want it to be quite flat. Um, yeah, we do. And then if we fill these pieces in here, uh, bop that on there. Good. And then we want this one. In the center on this piece. Yep. And. Yep. There we go. All right. Nice. Awesome. That looks beautiful. Yeah. That looks beautiful. All right. Okay. So we grab this. We want to paint all the inside to make it look pretty. Like this. Ba 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 bum. Uh, all of these pieces. They can all be painted. All of this. And this bit. And this bit. And actually, we might as well paint that too. All right, fantastic. Good. Oh, this is looking great. Um, what color do we want the entire thing to be? I'm not sure. Yeah, I really don't know. Um, okay, right, okay. Keep it going. Keep it going underneath. 
We'll have it go to the same point. There we go. And we'll try and fix this entire thing together and make it look pretty before we do anything else. Okay. Seems like a great plan. All right, bosh that there. This piece all the way across here. See, the problem is it has to float. It also needs wings uh, that allow it to float, kind of. Yeah. <laughs> um, which is a bit of a pain in the butt, but that's okay. Right, do this and this and this and this and this and this one. There we go. Uh, we're also going to fill that in there and same here. And that's everything filled in. We got no more jagged edges on the roof. Okay, the floor though. The floor needs filling. Here we go. We fill in the floor. Easy peasy. Right, that is looking very boxy towards the back, but the front of it looks okay. Yeah, the front of it looks fine. Okay, um, right, if we go inside, what height do we want the, the chair to be at? Think around this height. I'm not actually entirely sure where it goes, or where it should go. But I'm going to go with there, because that seems like a good plan. There we go. Alright, uh, seat. We want one of these. So we can see out of it. Yeah, that looks fine. Uh, let's do it in brown. For no real reason. In fact, we could actually put two seats up here. But we're only going to do one. Alright, bop that in there. See if we can see anything. Oh, it is actually smaller than I thought. It is definitely smaller than I thought. And more rectangular than I thought. But we can see, so that's good. Um, yeah, it's too rectangular. How do I fix that? We need to go down a bit more. We do, we need to go down a little bit more. But this isn't really helping. Okay, right, 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 right. That's fine. Okay, go ahead and clear that. Uh, resize grid. Copy the whole bottom bit off, or cut it off. There we go. And we'll try and make it more rounded. So, how do we do that? <laughs> How do we how do we make it more round? We actually end up doing something like this on the side. Okay, so say we do like uh Yeah, like this. I think. Is this right? So we we like grab one of these pieces and we put it on We put it on the side like that. I think. Yeah, because like towards the top is going to be flat. But as we go down, maybe? I don't know. Is this a good idea? We can make it taller by doing this. But we need it to come inwards also. And that's just difficult. <laughs> that's very difficult. Um. Yeah. Because then we need like a 2 by 4 One of these go there which doesn't really match doesn't really work no uh, uh okay right now i've just confused myself massively for some reason why did i do that i don't know right okay do this and then if we attach on i think it's these pieces i can't get my brain around this to go forwards to there. Okay, right, good. And then from this point onwards, we need these pieces, I think. Yeah, to go across the front. Okay, and then we delete that. We put in a new piece here, flip it around, and then bosh that forwards too. Okay, which means then we would have to do this, which is kind of ugly. Um, and also, the rest of the pieces don't really fit, do they? Unless they do. <laughs> um, yeah, right, okay. So we would have to, like, somehow put these on here. Which they don't go round from there. They only go round from here. You see? See, there's a, there's a problem. Although, actually, that would go... This would go there. Uh, and that could go down like that, I suppose. But what's the point of that? I don't know. I don't know what the point of that is. Okay, grab this. We're going to have a weird front anyway, because the Ekranoplans did have a weird front. But 
it wasn't this weird. <laughs> it wasn't. I mean, yeah. I like sim like I like symmetry, but if we can't have symmetry, we can't have symmetry. In terms of top and bottom. But this is actually all right because if we fill in this, we fill in this. What does it look like from the outside? I want it to look strange. So yeah, this actually goes towards looking strange, which is perfect. <laughs> weirdly, it is weirdly perfect. Okay, grab this. The front's gonna be very, 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 very pointy though. If we do it this way, it's gonna be insanely pointy. Uh, which isn't what we're going for, but actually, it works. Like it doesn't look too bad, which is fine. So we'll keep it. There we go. Wash that down to there. Awesome. We got a really weird looking front. But if we fill in all the pieces, like this bit, this bit, and this bit, then it looks much better than it did, I think. Yeah? It's not as round, but actually, that's not necessarily a bad thing. So, yeah. We'll keep it as it is. Alright, okay. So, can I put this anywhere? <laughs> can I put this anywhere? It doesn't really fit in some places, but actually... It would be better if we could put it on, because it's a nicer curve. Paste it. Let's see what let's see what we can do with this. Cause we might be able to make it look kinda cool. Alright, so we delete that one. Good. We delete this one. And this. There we go. Delete this piece and this piece. And that piece. And that piece. And that piece. Good. And then actually we wanna grab this. Fill in more of this. Like that. Yes. Okay, we probably want one of these to go there. I think. Y yes, like that. Good. And then empty this. Grab another one of these. Put that piece in there. Press U. There we go. All right, so we delete this. And we somehow attach that together. <laughs> I don't know how this is supposed to work. Uh, also, are those holes? How have we got holes in this? Oh, I see. Okay, they've been replaced. That makes sense. All right, cool. Well, we can put those back in. If we literally just flatten this to that point right there, and we follow it round with everything else. So, like, we put on... Uh, Oh, boy. <laughs> oh, boy, oh, boy. All right, we put on one of these pieces somewhere down here, like this. Uh, actually a 1x4, a 1x4 fits there. E yeah, uh... A 1x4 does fit there, but... Can we bring it out? No. If I put a piece on there, then it looks weird. Okay, right, that's good. Um, delete this and this. And then we just got to sort out this last little section and it'll be all right. So if we can do something like that, there we go. Bosh that in there. Good. We just want one piece to go on there, which is what? One of these, I think. There we go. Delete these ones and try and make it fit. There we, nope. <laughs> there we, nope. Okay, hold on. Uh, oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy. I didn't think I'd be getting into anything like this today. Okay, push that across there. Good. It looks a lot like the, um, uh, the spruce goose. Right, okay. Let's go ahead and put this on. Because that's the logical step there. Good. Delete these pieces. And put something in there, which would fit, like a 1x4 thingy. Uh, one of these? Yeah, which means that this now doesn't fit. Um, okay. Put that there. Delete this and this and this. And then just put one of those on there. Oh no, we want this piece on there. Here we go. Yep, and then we fill in this. And that. There we go, good. Now all we need to deal with is this bit. Um, 
Which seems like a difficult thing to deal with. There we go. Okay. Filled in. Okay, this piece needs filling in too. Which is semi impossible. Yeah, it's. Yeah, it is. Unless we have a bit pop out, which, I mean, I'm I'm kind of okay with. Having some little tiny flat surfaces, but not loads. Alright, okay, yeah. I th I feel like that mu looks much better than it did. So we'll keep it. Yeah. They have weird fronts on them anyway, so that's fine. Alright, cool. Spawn it in. We also need it to float nicer, so... Yeah, if it could be a tiny bit longer, like if this bit was stretched more, maybe that would look better. But it looks better than it did. Which is perfect. We can still see outside. We're a lot higher than we were. Um, yeah. You know what? I'm happy with this. This is a good start. Alright, so, with that being done, um, we're actually going to end this video here. It looks very strange, granted, but uh, hopefully in the next few videos we can make it look beautiful and uh, get it moving. Now, I'm not sure what kind of propulsion we want on this thing. I was going to go with a propeller, but um, jet engines are quite cool too. Uh, it's just... You definitely don't want your jet engines to touch the water. And it's a water plane. So, I don't know. We'll, we'll see what kind of setup we go for. Um, but I'm actually pretty pleased with the way the front is going to look. So, yeah. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.